What's happening on a kind of large scale is that Saudi is committed to generating 50% of its electricity from renewables by 2030. And so basically the, the state has decided to sponsor a bunch of large scale projects. Sponsor is kind of a complicated word. Essentially, the state is deciding that a bunch of large projects should be done as part of something they call repto tenders. The Ministry of Energy does this. And these are large scale, mostly PV projects in the middle of the desert. Some wind, there's been one large wind project done in Domita Jindal, but, but mostly PV projects. And there are large kind of mostly state-owned companies like Aquapower in Saudi, Musla from the UAE, EDF from France, and a few others that are competing to build these projects. And the PIF is doing a big chunk of them on, on its own direct as a direct award kind of thing, actually 70% of the projects. So those are the utility scale projects. And those are represent the largest portion of kind of our target and how we plan to get to, to this, this 50% number. But then underneath the surface, there's the kind of CNI scale or the commercial industrial scale. There are companies like Hala and others that are trying to build rooftop scale solar for data centers and large commercial uh, buildings and that sort of stuff. And they're kind of working from the ground up, trying to also contribute towards this kind of larger goal. The Saudi Green Initiative, as I understand it, and the Middle East Green Initiative are kind of larger umbrella terms that group together a bunch of other priorities and projects that the kind of state is, is, is sponsoring or is adopting. They include the kind of renewable energy development projects, but also other projects to do with environmental protection and the planting of trees and, and preventing des desertification and that sort of thing. Uh, and it's a public di diplomacy effort as well. So it's, a, it's an effort to kind of just inform people. Last, last year I was at COP and there was a big Saudi Green Initiative effort to kind of let people know that the state is taking this energy transition seriously and is making kind of progress and also trying to bring in partners as part of the Middle East uh, Green Initiative. But those things are pretty big picture things. At the level of Hala, we compete directly with the grid. So we're much more kind of, it's a much more mercantilist, like say, let's say a calculation. We provide energy at a certain number for 15 or 20 years, whatever kind of contract you want to sign. And the SEC, which is how the electricity company provides okay. electricity at a certain number. Ours is obviously clean. And you compare those two and you pick the one that suits you best. And so that doesn't have much to do with these kind of larger plans. Let's say it's more of a conventional business in that yeah. sense. But we do like participate or, or we do help contribute towards these larger goals.